In this video, we're going to use generative AI to generate a transcript. One of the cool new features in the all new Adobe Captivate is the ability now to analyze your slide and generate a transcript for the AI voices to narrate for you. And today we're going to show you how easily that can be done. All right, so one of the coolest features in the all new Adobe Captivate is the ability to generate a narration transcript for the AI voices in your Adobe Captivate to read for you. And it's so easy to do. You simply select a slide, you've designed this slide. This is actually a project that was originally a PowerPoint presentation file that I delivered live and in person. So I don't have any narration for it. I just kind of, you know, I had some notes previously, but those weren't imported in here. And I just want to take the content that's on screen and turn that into narration to go with this slide. And it's actually very easily done. We're gonna click on the generative AI button at the top of the slide here. And we're gonna click on generate transcript. It's going to analyze the on-screen text and generate some slide narration here. Now we can do a few things to this. If you want it to be more elaborate than what's there, we can elaborate the transcript. You know, we can maybe even add our own notes as well, but we can say something like, but keep it easy for someone with a grade eight education to read and comprehend. We'll just go ahead and send that off and see what comes back. So this looks pretty good to me. I think the one thing I might ask is please add a sentence instructing learners to press the right arrow in the play bar to go to the next slide at the end of the transcript. Yeah, so here it says to proceed, press the right arrow. This takes you to the next slide. So we'll go ahead and we'll add that transcript in. Looks good to me. We can, of course, uh, select a different narrator if we wish. So we can go to more voices. I'm going to select all the captions so that we're making changes to all of them. We can either search for a specific voice if you know the name of one of the voices, or you can use the filtering tools to select language, accent, gender, casual tone perhaps, and that's gonna give you a list of just a few to choose from. Let's preview these and see how they sound. They say behind every great man is a great woman, but let's be honest. I'm usually three steps ahead. Very nice. Hey, everybody. This is Juniper. I think I would be a great choice for your podcast. I'm pretty laid back and pretty casual. Give me a try. There is nothing which we receive with so much reluctance as advice. I kind of like Lindsay, so let's select her. Uh, and again, we can apply that to all of the captions on the slide. We'll go ahead and we'll generate the audio. And let's just give the entire slide a preview here. Welcome to Adobe's e-learning module. Today we explore branching. Branching offers learners choices. These choices lead to different paths. Learners experience consequences of their choices. This mirrors real life scenarios effectively. Storytelling techniques enhance learning experiences. Interactivity keeps learners engaged throughout. To proceed, press the right arrow. This takes you to the next slide. Sounds good to me. If you thought this video was helpful, please like and share it with your colleagues. If you need help with Adobe Captivate, hire Paul for one-on-one -on -one instruction. Paul's goal is to focus on lessons based on your specific needs. Visit his website at CaptivateTeacher.com. And don't forget to subscribe to his YouTube channel.